I am here. Didn't he? Hello. I've been doing a little bit of uh, Twitch research. Looking at viewer lists and such. And, uh, you know. Turns out, much to my suspicion, the two in the chat are bots. Which is unfortunate, but it was pretty obvious. They're here before everybody else. Whatever. How's it going, Didney? I know. Well. What'd you get for food? All right. As always, it's hot. Oh yeah, I think raisin uh, canes chicken. Hmm. I've never heard of that. It is currently seventy-one degrees outside. Eight five here. Oof. Yeah, have fun with that. Very humid though. Yeah, that's the, uh, that's almost the worst part. Can I... I'm curious, can I ban bots? No, I can't. Oh, wait, I can. Yeah. Zero messages and... All right, cool. Bots banned. Okay. So, uh, I watched the best friends LP up into up until the point of where I just uh, ended, and they figured out that Zeppelin command console thing in like two minutes. So clearly, I'm the dumb one. But it's okay. Oof. Man, the atmosphere is super creepy. The loading screens, uh, loading times in this game are pretty significant, if I do say so myself. Damn it, blue. Oh well, whatever. Wow, huh? This loading screen, huh? Could have hunted an entire Jagras while this was going. Like, dang. All right, Theta. Here we go.
Strasky, wake up Dr. Masters. We're bringing in anchors. What's wrong? What can I say? He's had a rough day. He's all butchered by structure shrapnel. The lab sure did a number on him. Brandon, flip the panic switch on the seat. I don't want to burn through the oxygen. You're kidding, right? He's fucking hanging on by a thread. We need to move him. Strasky, get the infirmary ready. We need to move fast. Wait. Where are Kumarabi and the others? This is all we got. I guess it's still at Delta. Now, I can't do this on my own. Grab the other side. Strask, ready or not, we're coming in. All right. See you soon. So it sounds like some good things happened. This thing on? Can everyone hear me? Go ahead, Strom. Listen up, all members of staff. The art project has caused a lot of arguments the last few months. I'm not gonna pretend I understand what the hell Sarang talked about and how his continuity suddenly made sense to kill yourself. For the fucking love of God, or whatever you think is important, don't kill yourself. This place is miserable enough. Don't force your friends to clean up your blood. Rest in peace. Quality. Good? Beautiful, sir. All right, everyone. Show's over. Get back to work. Uh, that's... That's one of the most fucked up audio dialogues I've ever heard. Audio dialogues? That doesn't make any sense. Audio logs. I can figure this out. Yeah, it gets worse. Beep boop. Serious. Swipe it a sweet beady. Wow, that closed up real fast. Heavy duty drains working on this place. Which I guess is the point. Oh. Okay. This is more brightly lit than I thought it would be. Hello? Anyone there? Well, Catherine, we found Theta. Bless you. Thank you. <laughs> okay, well, that's fair.
This would have worked too. Whoops. Popcorn? No, it's paper. Not quite yet. Squeeze me. Stress bowel. Still moving. That's some good spin on it. We're here. We're here. Okay, great. Time to hijack ourselves a submarine. There will be nothing stopping us when we have the done that. You guys sure have a lot of machines and vehicles down here. What makes this one so special? It's the only transport that can go into the abyss without cracking like a can of soup. If this is one of a kind, then how did they get the Ark down the abyss in the first place? That's a good question. I suppose they did it the hard way and just walked. Didn't realize that was an option. Kath, what's it like inside the Ark? Is it like a movie or virtual reality? No, of course not. It's, you know, like real life, but slightly better. Pleasant temperature, clean air, good weather. So people in the Ark just walk around pretending it's the real world? You don't have to pretend. It's perfectly immersive. And it can just sustain itself? Yes. Attached to a probe, fueled by solar panels, it could survive for thousands of years. That's amazing. Just thinking about the Earth being what it is, and us setting out to save the final remains of humanity, it's... It's... Heroic? Uh, at least it feels worth doing. Here we go. The Dunbat! Oh, damn it. I knew it was too good to be true. Yeah, of course. What's wrong? It's... It's quarantined. Hold on. We need a security cipher. How bad is it? It's we don't write these things down type of bad. Maybe someone's still around who can tell us what it is. Hmm. Sure, let's go with that. I'll just unlock the other doors for you so you can explore the station. We need to find someone who knows the cipher. It's the only way to fire up the Dunbat. So you just want me to leave the Omni tool here? Find someone who knows the security cipher. Alright. Ooh. All systems operational. Uh, 99%. Life support, the wham. Temperature 13C. Pressure that. Diagnostic was a year ago. Or a year before everything started going bad. Okay, I'm here. That's the main level that I just walked into. That's a new place, and all the gray stuff is locked. Okay. Looks like all your friends moved downstairs. Why abandon the gate? In the habitat? That's so strange. I don't like this at all. Yeah, me neither. Wow. Okay, so Emma Alvaro is probably around here somewhere. If not a robot. Wow, that's a lot of people. Hold on, let me look at this. Are there any names here we can recognize? Stratsky. I know that one. Isn't Jane Adams? No, I don't know. Find someone who knows okay. the security cipher. 
I guess I'll just leave that here. This is the bathroom? Okay. Security cipher. Huh. Thought this was a pinball machine. Man, I don't care for this place at all. Yeah. Oh no, I think it's him. Okay, you don't get to say things like that. Sorry. Oh my god, a dead end. <laughs> okay, okay.
Are you serious? Fine, you know what? Just fuck it. Reset my mobility. Okay, so there are two empty rooms and a giant maze with a, with a monster in it. Okay. Okay, so this one's nothing. Confirmed. There, again, seems to be nothing in here. Advice, didn't he? Oh, this might not be him, but still. Ugh. here. Why would they all leave this floor? I don't get it either. It's like they all just cleared out. What's so interesting downstairs? Just labs and offices. Maybe the shuttle station. Did you go check? I don't know. Got a bad feeling about this. Oh yeah, now you tell me. Thanks. Welcome to my place. When I started the art project, I pretty much lived in this place. Yeah. What is this? Yeah. They want me to go downstairs, and I'm not really interested. You know, let's let maintenance do that. This is where I would store the ARC scans. So you saved the whole staff digitally on these chips? That was the plan. Damaged.
fast. Broken. An intact memory chip. If we're lucky, we might be able to extract the cipher from it. I'm just going to assume there's only the one, but... So didn't they just say these were all the people they stored onto the, the Ark? Uh, everybody seems kind of dead if that's the case. Need to fix that mainframe connection. I'd rather not. Hello. Hey, Blue. Welcome to the underwater bad times hour and a half. I'm your host. Hello, Blue. Scared out of my butt. This is where I did my scan. And all the other. You don't remember? My scan was the first. Had to test the scanner before I could start making promises. Laughing. Wait, can I pilot this and make the, the robot go do it? I need help in I the lab. Paying the half scan attention room. caused this boss fight. What sense. happened? That's fair. Conrad killed himself after the scan. Jesus, how? Um, laser tool? What should I do? I'm gonna need to tell Strohmeyer. No, please! I'm so close. Strohmeyer's gonna shut down the ARC project. It's not my fault people keep killing themselves. Catherine, what are you gonna do? It's not like you can sneak a 300-pound body out of the lab. I know. Catherine, are you okay? Not even close. Man, I really don't want to go downstairs. From what I saw, there doesn't seem to be, like, an easy solution to the... Alright, I'm going. Why the heartbeat? Stop it. to the shuttle station in case something went wrong. You really stuck on that one. I'm just worried about my colleagues. Hmm. 
Water don't work. Quit it. Be brave, then. Dear friends, when you read this, I will have entered the Ark. As I have explained, this is accomplished by ceasing to live as your scan is being completed. Do not frighten Catherine. I will do this in secret by folding cyanide salts into chewing gum and placing it in my mouth before seeing her. When I hear her announcement, when I hear her announce completion, I will bite down, quickly causing my own demise. When you discover the truth behind my death, know there is no tragedy to mourn, for I am victorious. I advise you all to do the same and join me inside the Ark. What does that say? Are these puzzle solutions? Questions about self. Who are you? What does it mean to be human? Does your body or your surroundings confine or define you? All very difficult ideas to approach without having your questions be invalidated by the practical or mystif-
was not expecting that to break. Before we go back downstairs, let's see if either of the two chips I got. The laboratory terminals have lost contact with the mainframe. We need to reset the router downstairs. Don't worry, I'll take care of it. The terminals in my laboratory have lost connection to the mainframe. Head downstairs and reset the router. Bitch. What if I don't wanna? Okay, Didney, if you know, is the solution to turning the stuff back on in that room with with the with the monster? Like don't tell me where it is, just tell me if it's in that room. If you know. If you don't then just don't bother. Uh. Okay. Trying to remember. Did you press anything in the room with the monster? No, I got to the back of the room and I came to a console that told me I had to reset the router. Or reset something. But other than that, I didn't touch anything. The reset is there. Okay.
You're doing good. Are you serious? Good job, Sam. This better have worked. I'm not going down there again. I mean, of course there's another one. Like, there literally has to be. Weird screen glitching going on. Try running a simulation from the chip you found. Someone must know the cipher. And of course, the now that I've beaten one of them, the other one has to show up in the. Fine, 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 fine. Arc scan log. You're a bit brave dog. Ben, a bit brave dog. <laughs> uh, Catherine was first. Nikolai, Jasper, Sarah, Ian, Heather, Mark. Mark was the last one, it seems like. Last well, one, two, three, four, five, six people. Seven. So they stopped doing the arc at some point over the course of uh, January, February, March, May, June, July, August, like three months. Hmm. the final boss. Yeah, I wish. Oh, you! Good luck! There should be a list of people. See if there's anyone who could know a security cipher. Okay. Let's see. Compressed. Delivering the Ark. Let's 
So this is my list. Probably that one. Okay, so I'm going to guess this one. No, it won't work. We need someone from Theta Security Group. Okay. Does it say anywhere... Wait, there was... Now, there's just a big list of people. This isn't what their jobs were. Wasn't there a list like that somewhere? Hmm. I mean, it's obviously not going to be the first one. That one won't work either. Look for security people at Kronstadt or Stromeyer. Okay, but you're not, like, telling me what any of their jobs are. Working for Strohmeyer. Very promising. I'll just load him up and get the simulator going. There we are. What are we doing exactly? We're going to have a talk with Mr. Wan. Use the computer to activate the simulation. Dr. Chun, is that you? What happened? What is this place? Just be calm. Take a deep breath and enjoy the scenery for a moment. Dr. Chun? I hear your voice, but there's no one here. There's no one here! It's empty. It's too empty. There's something really wrong with this place. It's not real! This isn't real! I have to get out of here! Like, you knew it wasn't we real, what? I mean, he's a perfect scan, meant for the Ark. He's the real deal. And we turned him off. Took it all away again. I really thought that was gonna work. Maybe we can try again. That wasn't so bad. This room I really got me worked up. Bastard. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Take it easy, Mr. Wan. Chun? What happened? I, I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. It's okay. It's all a part of the scam. No, no, that, that's a lie. You're lying. Okay, calm down, Mr. Wan. No, 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 no. Well, why, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, Chun. I trusted you! Okay. Do we need to turn it off? Can we just keep him alive until we've got the cipher? The longer he's exposed to the computer model, the more he'll get hung up on it. So, what's wrong with letting him settle in a little? It would drive him insane. So let's keep the session short and the suffering to a minimum. Okay, well, this isn't going to work either. 
That wasn't so bad. This robot really got me worked up, bastard. What? What is this? Where am I? Relax, Mr. Wan. Just keep calm. Dr. Chun? What the hell is this place? I need a favor. I need to know what the new security cipher is. Why are you doing this? Is this some trick? I'm not giving you anything. I'm trying to save a lot of people. No, you're lying. This is all a lie. Look at this place. It's a fucking joke. Get me out of here, Chun, or I'll punch your teeth in! Okay, great. I think we need to build the scene so it's more what he'd expect. As soon as he starts to doubt, we've lost him. You're right. We need to think this through. We need some more data. Okay. Where was he on the list? August 25th? Okay, well, it doesn't tell me anything. Let's look around some more in here, I guess. That's what I was doing. Well, oh, this is open now. Ah, I see. What? Check the terminal. I just want to make sure. Oh, me. Kath, what is this? Why do you have a file of me? You are one of Dr. Munchie's templates. A legacy scan. Well, this is important. Okay, so... Okay, so... The Simon I am, I guess, wouldn't under... Yeah, w is, was made the first time Thank the scan you. was made. So, all of these would be new to me. Okay, that's it. Wow, that was fun. That's a relief. Still figuring this out, so... This freaky, so many lights. What do we do now? Paul and I are going to run tests for a week or so, and then we'll work out a roadmap to your recovery. Well, I feel excited. Can't wait to get back to the living. We've worked everything out. Everything is legal. Vouched for by Dr. Peak and Professor Wei. Oh, that's great news. No big change in medication. You'll be taking an aspirin every morning, but that's about it. Paul worked out a diet with some variations you should try out. You can continue doing physical therapy. Also, there's some extra cardio training every other day. Okay, getting complicated. Don't worry, it's really not. We're gonna keep an eye on you every week, so we'll be able to adjust the plan if needed. The model was sound. It should have worked. It's not your fault, David. I really wish things had turned out differently. Yeah, me too. I was supposed to save you. Hey, you got my brain on file. Maybe you can put it to some use. <laughs> yeah, who knows? You'd be okay with that? Using it for my research? Sure. It's like a part of me lives on or something. Like a donated organ. You know what sucks about dying? What? The crash. Everything up till now, the brain damage. You guys, everything. It's made my life so much more real. I started thinking about all the things I was going to do. I'd never been more excited to be alive. All that hope. Wasted. It's rough. Probably not do that. So fucked up and tragic he died not long after his scan. Barely a month. Yeah.
Like... <coughs> okay, there... There's an erase data button here, and I want to know if that affects the ending. Because it feels like it should. But I should probably not touch that. What's a legacy scan? They're historic templates for AI construction. Any self-respecting engineer wouldn't use legacies anymore, but they're great for learning. They come with every development kit. So, my brain scan turned into a template for artificial intelligence. The ending is the same. Gotcha. So much for that mystery. No magic or time travel needed. I was here all along, waiting for someone to shove a picture of my brain into a suit and hit the power button. If that's the case, why did he get turned on when the no multiple endings. when the station was abandoned? What? Hmm. Like, nobody knew about him, apparently. Why did... That wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up, bastard. What? Where did it... Alice? The scan is done. Are you feeling all right, Mr. Wan? Chun? Where's Alice? She had to leave. Listen, I really need to know the new security cipher. What? Why? Why would you need that? This is the trick. Please calm down. I knew you couldn't be trusted. None of this is real. But you won't break me, Wow. You hear me? You won't break me! How many times are we gonna have to do this? Come on, Simon. Don't give up now. Okay. I need some kind of module. I have an idea. Here we go, Brandon Wan's room. I'll just override the lock for you. Yeah. If we get to know him, maybe we can make the simulation a little smoother. God, I'm glad I thought of this. Okay, so he traveled. Origami frog. Brandon. Catherine's pretty emotionally distant. Well, yeah, she's a. Well, yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. Really a mess thinking about the scan. Everyone is being so brave, all smiles, no regrets. You know how you said you would hold my hand during the scan? Driver still stands, I gratefully accept. If we do it together, we will suffer the hangover together as well. They say it takes a couple days to recover. Kisses out. A letter from someone named Alice. They were together during the scan. You know her? He was close with Coster. I would not have expected that. Can you use that somehow? Well, keep looking. It's fucked up if I have to load Alice, too. Cute. Akers finally agreed to evacuate Delta. Goya, Cryer, and I moved into Theta today. Akers said he'd stick around for a while longer. The crazy bastard, I take pride in my work. Goddamn, that place is miserable since the surface stopped sending parts. Alice and Brandon were definitely together during the scan. Good to know. Maybe we can use that somehow. I'm glad he just got all that information before I even read it. Did my arc scan together with Alice? Strohheimer did... Uh, told me that the hangover would basically kill me. Such an asshole. I was fine at first, but got a splitting headache a couple hours later. The biggest pain was that Chun girl. So fucking uncomfortable at all times, man. My skin crawl. Strahheimer went ballistic and shut down all future scans for the ARC project. Apparently Conrad wanted in on the continuity and just fried himself right in the pilot seat after the scan. Something tells me we'll be getting new security ciphers. 
just heard that the Kamorabi, 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 Shadow team is going to Delta to pick up Acres. He's been alone for months now. Can't imagine what he's been up to. Brandon, you ready to go? Strohmeyer says it's time to move. I'm waiting for Strasky and Alvaro to pack up their stuff. Head downstairs, I'll meet you there. Don't take too long. Don't worry, we're right behind you. I think I just heard Alice talking to Brandon on the intercom. Seems like they were getting ready to leave. You got that from the intercom? Must be a transmission buffer. Hang on. Great, this is exactly what we need. I think we've got this, Simon. Was doing swell. I can synthesize just Alice's voice from the honest, intercom but nothing and much. use it to impersonate her for the simulation. Is we that what happened? Into feeling safe enough to open up. Great. Definitely feeling good about this. Good job with the intercom. I didn't know you could data mine. What's it like? It's just something that I do now. So it comes naturally to you. That's really interesting. Those yeah, were his eyes sure found yesterday. yesterday. I... But it said that a Acres got off of... Like, he left. So he tore out his eyes and left? Like, were they his eyes, or were they someone else's? Yeah. Okay. It's pretty fucking metal, honestly. I compiled an Alice module that we can use. So she'll be with Brandon in the simulation. Sort of. I'll still need to do the talking, but it'll sound and look like Alice. Man, Catherine's starting to sound more and more like the ultimate villain in this game, but I know she's not. Well, I don't know she's not. I just feel like she's not. Because the villain, quote-unquote... I think you left a message about his eyes. Uh, that wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up, bastard. Well, that's what you get for listening to his stories. I guess I had it coming. About Stromar. He said he needed a new site for ASAP. What should I tell him? It's all right. I could talk to him. Wait. Didn't Sean just tell you to take it easy? Don't worry. I'm not going to tell anyone. I do feel hungover. Okay. It's 1729 over 42. 12 over 407. Got it? Yeah, I got it. I'm sorry, Mr. DeLong. Brandon. Goodbye. What do you mean? No, wait. That's enough. We got what we need. Is that what we are? Simulations? Yeah, but it shouldn't make any difference. You're still you. I'm not sure what to do with the data. You decide. Ooh. I don't understand the difference here. Oh, this is done? Okay, well. I thought I would just put them back in my inventory, but whatever, I guess. Bye, Brandon. Okay, so what triggered? What spawned now that this is done? <laughs> Shut down. I think his brain scan is still alive. All right. Hey, how about fuck you? How about fuck you? How, how about fuck you? And... Okay, fine. Simon, we got it. We can get to the dumbat now. Get back here.
The legacy is going to be that was on the computer. What did you use it for? It's a template that has an intelligence password already etched into the base. So if I wanted to build an AI, I wouldn't have to reinvent a whole model. There you are, just warming up the Dunbat for us. It's been collecting dust for months, so it might need a minute. Okay, that's it. That's everything. Yeah, so one of the messages Akers leaves mentions huh. how he heard a voice tell him he doesn't huh. need his eyes to Never see. Never mind. What do you need me to do? Head inside the dock. The Omnitool can open the door now. And get into the Dunbat. Then plug me I'm in and I'll sure take us into the abyss. One. Sounds easy enough. I do remember saying that. I like mention that. For some, uh, if you'll remember, uh, finding those two things were far enough apart that I don't remember putting those, putting two and two together. Understandable LOL. Okay, so what's gonna find its way in here and try to kill me? If I could even find a way to... Oh, I'm dumb. Yeah, kind of starting to sound like Catherine's the villain here. Or the wow is Catherine's fault. Something she did.
Is that another one? Or is it the same one? Looks like it could be the Ark. Alright, let's read up before we talk to her. I decided to finalize the Ark with the scans we have. I'm sorry for all of you who wanted to go but didn't get the chance to scan yourself before the project was put on hold. It's been two months since I've added a scan and I don't see how I'll ever be able to win back the support you all showed me when we started the project. I'm sorry. I never meant for anyone to take their lives. It was never my intention to fool anyone. I just wanted to save something. Apply interface module. See art capsule. Ask permission from 4Q. Brief them. Take shuttle to Omicron. Pick up power suits. Ride the climber into the abyss. Recoup at Tau. Head to the launch site. Load the bullet. Launch arc. They are still on Tau. Ooh, another survey. Recently, it was decided that the ARC project would become Pathos 2's last official commitment. The staff has begun... Staff has been urged to carry on with their duties, despite Earth's... God damn it. The staff has been urged to carry on with their duties, despite Earth's catastrophic condition. I think the ARC project is the most logical step towards saving mankind and that we should spend as much time and resources as needed to complete it. Okay, well, here's the thing. It's... As far as they know, um, everything's been wiped out. So as far as they know, they're the only survivors of mankind. And... Uh, sending their shit into space. Like, what does that do for them? Pretty much. I don't... Like, unless they... Because all that's going to end up being is... The, the rest of humanity lives on a disc in space for the rest of time. Or aliens pick it up. So... And even if they do pick it up, like, what does that mean then? Like, they download schematics it's into robot bodies? To survive in some form. Yeah, I don't know. I don't really see the point of that. Like, I understand that you, you wouldn't want to give up, but... Humanity just can't accept extinction. To embark, every passenger needs to be flushed with electromagnetism using a pilot seat. These scanning sessions are known to cause nausea and headaches, sometimes lasting up to three days. I think temporarily, temporary physical discomfort, no matter how severe, is a small price to save mankind. Well, for that last line, sure. But considering the... Considering the context, again, I disagree. It's kind of pointless. The Ark is bit to f built to fit a Ranger Mark 7 probe, meaning it could be shot into space with the Omega space gun and technically survive for thousands of years, living off the light from our sun and distant stars. I think the, er the Ark should leave Earth behind and be launched into space. This, I actually... I don't know. Because if you find the Ark on Earth, and you're not the only survivors, then they can maybe do something with that. 
But if you are the only survivors, there and you know you send the ark into space, and there's nothing for other people to find. So I, I'm banking on there still being people alive and being able to find this place. So I once again disagree. Plus, the odds of being hit by debris in space is likely. Absolutely. The, digital, the digitalization of humanity is an opportunity to make a quantum leap in our own evolution. People in the Ark will be out of necessity, will out of necessity be generated from existing genetic code, but could be altered to allow for cosmetic changes, ease aging, and even prevent death. So they could still die is what you're saying. I think we are at risk of losing our morality if we were to rid ourselves of disease and our own mortality. Well, yeah, that's the whole point, but if all of you just died before someone found you, like, these are really shitty questions, honestly. Like, the entire situation is a bad thing. But I agree with Agreed. this. Just being immortal means nothing. But the fact that they want... Like, in the last question, they said that... They, is it in this question? No, it's in the last question. That the art could survive for thousands of years, but what would that mean for all the people who are just stuck in a simulation for that whole time? I do actually agree that getting rid of sickness and dying kind of loses meaning if you're just you know. there are only 58 people left alive to be stored inside the ark a way to diversify and expand the population would be would be to introduce artificial intelligence that would uh, in every way appear to be human but with childlike and naive sensibilities as we continue to explore the nature of intelligence it may find a way to make them smarter in the future. I think even an inferior group of artificial people would benefit our society. Well, that's just kind of going on the whole, you know, our AI people. And I don't think it's fair to call them inferior group of people when... Uh... But at the same time, I do agree with the sentiment that, yes, AI would benefit the ARCs people since it's already that kind of thing. But I don't strongly agree. Yeah. I'm just going to take a screenshot of this really quick. All right, Catherine, what do you have to say for yourself? Could you, like, heck off? Huh? Wait, this isn't... Oh, no! Wow got to the Dunbat before we did, am I right? Last well, chair. I was talking. That's rarely a good sign. Damn it. The Dunbat was our best shot. I was really banking on this to work. Why does it sound like she got farther away from the now. microphone? There's got to be another way. How do you think you did it? How did the team get the Ark down the Abyss in the first place? If they didn't use the Dunbat, the only other way would be the climber at Omicron. Fuck. It's like an elevator which supposedly reaches all the way down into the Abyss. Fuck off. Okay, so we do that. We go to Omicron and take the elevator. I don't want yeah. to. Okay. Sure. We'll just head over to Omicron and hope there's a power suit that fits you. You know, so you don't implode while in the abyss. <laughs> that does sound useful. All right, let's go then. Wait, what is this place? Seems to be a lot of information on the art here. There's a prototype and everything. Okay. Let's start it up. I want to see how it works. Maybe we can figure out how to get on the arc. You didn't know how to get us on? How difficult could it be? Start an art simulation. I want to see how it works. How would I do that, Catherine? Uh, 
Okay, so I want to point out at this point, after I've gone through all of these feelings that I have about the project, about how it's kind of pointless to launch the Ark in, I believe that it's kind of pointless to launch the Ark into space since there's nothing out there. Uh, there's no point for digital recreations of people to survive in space for a thousand years when it has as much potential to be destroyed in space as just... It has more potential to be destroyed in space than just sitting on a shelf somewhere. But if you find it in like on a shelf, like as a another Earthling survivor, you could do something with that again. So I kind of feel like this entire journey is pointless because I disagree with the protagonist. But that's just me. What's this? <laughs> Give it a try. Bit of a tight fit. Can you reach the on switch? Should I be worried about radiation? I think we're beyond that. Interesting. You seem to be one with the diving suit you're wearing. Everything's meshed together. How's that gonna work with the suit we're picking up at Omicron? Um. I think they're bigger. You should be able to wear them both. Imogen? Who's that? It looks like the basis for your body is one of my old colleagues. A standard cortex chip for robots, including the data reader and the ocu torch, has just been forced through the skull. What? Structure gel has fused the whole construction together. Amazing stuff. No, 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 no. Hold on. Back up. I'm one of your old colleagues? Well, your body is. Imogen Reed. That's disgusting. Hey, don't say that. She was my... She was nice to me. Anyway, the she was her what? chip is good news. That means we can transfer your mind to the Ark with a pilot seat. Kath, I'm half a dead person. Yes, it makes sense. Think about it. All those simplistic minds we In run into... Man. Just reviving a dead person doesn't seem to work that well. A robot body seems to make people a bit unreliable. You are the best of both worlds. A sound mind and a sound body. So that ex at least we know how to get on the arm. Sort of. I understand the concept, but I don't know the specifics. I really wish we could figure out how the scan data is formulated and processed. So that explains the uh, the face that was in the thumbnail that you sent me. Like, up until now, we've been a faceless protagonist, but now we have a face, and it's a lady face. Wow, that's so cool. It's the whole gang. A crew photo? Really? Who are you saving this for? The world was dead. Thanks, Simon. Yeah. I thought being an asshole wasn't invented until the 22nd century. Now I know better. Uh, no, it was not. For the safety of you and your colleagues, put on the, the, the undersuit and body harness. Check the HPS for any visual damage. Starting with the legs, fix the parts on your harness and work yourself upward. Lock all the pieces together as you go. Let a partner help you with the back piece and the torso. Tap the secure button on your arm piece. You should hear the suit seal itself. The suit will then start to equalize pressure and tap into the oxygen tank. If the suit isn't doesn't seal itself, flex the shock absorbers and try again. It still doesn't work. Do not try to fix it yourself. Contact maintenance. Note the HPSers S's are very heavy and the suit will compensate. You will effectively be stronger than you think you are. Be careful. Do not hold your breath. Do not stay out too long. Don't dive too deep. Don't dive with malfunctioning equipment. Power packs. Is that a shopping list? Uh, I'm going to take a screenshot of this. Just in case. That's Phi, all right. Quick stop at Omicron, then Tau, then Phi. Let's do it. 
Okay. Fuck that all away. Okay. How do you start simulation? Ma'am? Get an arc simulation going. Uh. You guys and your dang old spoilers. Okay. So, Ali. Wait, what? Wait, so all of these are required? Yeah, this part is frustrating, it seems. Okay. So we need a base. We need this. We need the forest. Okay, so which is this? Okay, so we need this. What can we get away with? Okay, we don't need that. We need light. So we need this. This is so... This part... No, that's too big. Don't need that. We need some kind of water, so the lake takes up way too much. No. The lake takes up less space, but it still needs the same amount of mons. Why do we need water? It's so frustrating.
So I can take the river or the lake. The lake is less, but I still need all of these physics. And that's too much. So, so okay, I need this. This puts it over. Okay. Wait. Will that do it? No, I need a light source. Uh, this is... Ugh, fuck's sake. Okay, so what do I not need? Why do I need the advanced version? Why can't I just... Hmm... Just fucking put everything on there. I don't need like 90% of this. If I could change the scene to the planes, it would lighten up the load. Do you have any tips? Get an arc simulation. Go no, on. you're worthless. The arc doesn't even look that bulky. This is gonna be easy. You haven't heard of the concept of jinxing, have you? Sorry, I forgot your people were superstitious. Yeah, we didn't also waste however many terabytes on a forest. God, I hate this woman. Why can't I have this one? Wait a minute. Okay, so it has to be one of these two, and they both take up too much space. Oh, great, whatever. I don't know what Try changed that time, scan. but fuck it. It shouldn't be that difficult. I just want to make sure I understand how the scan data is formulated before we start messing around with the real arc. Hooray. Run the simulation and then hit pause while the code is running. It'll give me a cross-section of the process. Better not use real data. I don't want to repeat what we did to Brandon. Second that. while the dummy is loaded, otherwise I can't know if it's working or not. Wait, you want me to pause... Try pausing it when the dummy is loaded. No, try again. The dummy needs to be loaded when you pause. Okay, I see what they want here. You need to catch it while it's being loaded. Okay. 
I was about to freak out for a minute. It's like, how the, how the hell was I supposed to do that? Yes, of course. So precise, so perfect. Nothing like admiring your own work. What? Oh, right. You can get Are what we you need him? Can we go to Omicron and get my new suit now? Yeah, we should get going. Wanna bring this arc as a backup? No, that wouldn't work. This is just a prototype. Good. I prefer to travel light. Let's go. Don't forget to take me with you. Yeah, I'm just gonna carry the villain around for the rest of the game, no big deal. You uh, you might want to stop here for today, then. Yeah? Okay. Let's get back in that other room, then. Oh, good. Because, like, I figured it would just be that door and all of this was optional, but... Of course not. It's never that easy. Okay, well, uh, there we go. Next so, stream, say hello to Acres. Oh, goody. Well, I know that was basically all just dicking around, trying to, you know, figure out what Theta was, but. Honestly, you could probably speed run that whole thing in like five minutes, so. You know, just kind of bumbling my way through this game is probably going to take a lot longer than it should. Uh, once again, after the stream, I'm going to catch up on the best friends let's play this game. Thanks for streaming. Up until where I stopped. Uh, but for now, thanks for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Bye.